Roommates, it looks like a verdict has finally been reached in the trial of Eric Holder in relation to the death of the late Nipsey Hussle, and the internet is not holding back about it. There's a lot to unpack with this one, so we'll take it from the top so you know. As most of you know, Eric Holder was originally arrested in connection with the murder of Nipsey Hussle in early 2019 when it was revealed that he shot the beloved rapper after an alleged altercation outside of his Los Angeles clothing store. And after the jury deliberated that lasted six hours, Eric Holder was officially found guilty of first degree murder for the fatal shooting of Nipsey Hussle back in March of 2019. It didn't take long for fans and celebs alike to comment with their opinions on the verdict either, child. Lil Duvall made his feelings loud and clear when he commented and said, that's not enough, we need a harsher verdict than guilty. Another roommate chimed in with well wishes for the family saying, praise for Lauren, hopefully she gets some sense of peace with this. In addition to the first degree murder charge, Holder was also charged with two counts of attempted voluntary manslaughter because two bystanders were hit with gunfire during the shooting. It was just last week that Eric Holder's trial was rescheduled after reports of him being beaten up in jail by multiple suspects and a photo of his injuries shared by his attorney sent the internet into a frenzy. During the alleged attack, Holder was cut by a razor and taken to the hospital where he received an MRI and staples in the back of his head. After the photo went viral on social media, Tanisha Foster, the mother of Nipsey Hussle's daughter Imani, did not hold her tongue when she shared a comment stating, I'm turning up when he takes his last breath. And she's definitely not the only one who had something to say about the viral photo because people did not hold back in the comments, child. Holder could get life in prison when he's sentenced on September 15th. Roomies, it's been almost three years of legal back and forth as well as court delays because of the pandemic. But it seems like in this case that long-awaited justice was finally served. What are your thoughts on the verdict? Roommates, thanks for watching TSR So You Know of the Week. Share your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to subscribe. Keep watching so you know.